breaking loud. Breaking loud, breaking loud. Breaking loud, breaking loud. Truth, talk, tell, and show. Truth is, I'm going to tell the truth for my whole life. Truth is, I'm going to tell the truth with all my might. Truth is, God is pleased with the truths I tell. Truth is, my truths are the reason why I'm doing so well. Truth is, Nobody but God could have did this. Truth is, these are the truths that you do not want to miss. Truth is, truth is, the truth does not need any support, but I do. Like, subscribe, and set your notifications. Truth and love is what you will receive here as well as in the comments. Let's talk truth, let's tell, and let's show. Let's have a dialogue. Truth is... Good morning. God's morning blessings. Hey, Sister Michael, you the first one. Good morning, sis. I am here. God's morning blessings. Hey, sis. Hey, Anna. Hey, sis. Hey, Fredrina. God's morning blessings, y'all. God's morning blessings, y'all. Welcome to the Relentless Road. Breaking live, breaking live. If you know, you know. I speak the truth, but I also show the proof. So come on in, y'all. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. I want her to say my name. I just want her to say my name. See, one thing I know, two things for sure, and I'm jumping straight in because y'all already know the Holy Spirit is on 10,000 this morning. The Holy Spirit is on 10,000 this morning to God be the glory. But I just want to come on in. I'm coming in, hitting the gas, no brakes. The brakes is all gas, no brakes, y'all. All gas, no brakes this morning. All gas, no brakes. All gas, no brakes. All gas, no brakes. I was excited to see you this morning after last night live. All gas, no brakes. Yes, sis. All gas, no brakes. Hey, sister Lakeisha, welcome back. Welcome back. We miss you, sis. Lakeisha, we miss you, sis. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Y'all already know. It's breaking loud with relentless road. Y'all already know. It's all gas, no brakes. It's all gas, no brakes. The brakes been broke for two, two and a half years plus. The brakes been broke on this exposing assignment. This is all gas, no brakes. But what I really truly enjoy about this assignment, y'all, I enjoy watching the manifestation of what the Holy Spirit told me. The Holy Spirit told me on September the 9th, 2021, that if I would be obedient... If I would be obedient, if I would remain relentless, if I would do this assignment without stopping, that the Holy Spirit guaranteed me that I would witness Jamila exposing herself. And that's what I'm doing. That's what y'all doing. We are witnessing the manifested evidence of what the Holy Spirit spoke to me on September the 9th, 2021, when the Spirit spoke to me to expose Jamila with the evidence in my phone to do it funny, hilariously, comically, but keep it the truth. That is where Michelle Chappelle came. Those of y'all that know the whole long rod, y'all know, y'all know the ride. But I'm 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 honored. I'm honored that I live in Jamila's head rent free. People is paying Jamila to beef with me. Hey, Sister Shay, people are paying Jamila daily to beef with me. This is what the Holy Spirit told me. Those people get on the live every day to hear Jamila beef with me without saying who she beefing with. Today, I didn't heard it out. I didn't heard it out. Let me stop. Let me stop right there. Let me, let me, let me give y'all a little. Hey, um, God's morning blessings, my beautiful niece. Let me give y'all a little 
Let me give y'all a little proof before I go to talking, y'all. Because y'all already know. I speak the truth, but I show the proof. Let me give y'all a little proof. I gave y'all proof on yesterday how she got in the camera on Easter Sunday. I was all up... I was all up on her mind while she was supposed to have been preaching a Resurrection Sunday to where she had to get up in the camera and talk to me. I'm honored. I'm honored that Jamila acknowledges me. I, I thank God for the free promotion. You, Jamila, you promoted me for free when I was up under your leadership because you spoke my name every single day. But now, God's morning blessing, Sister Yolanda, but now you promote me incognito. You, you promote me. You promoting me. You promoting me. Look at Jacqueline Vince. God's morning blessings, Jacqueline. She said, I want that shirt. Satan, right chick, wrong day. Right chick, wrong day. Today is the day, y'all. Today is the day for me. Y'all see how I come up geared? Today is the day. Jamila, you are Satan. So I say to you right now, right chick, wrong day. Right chick, wrong day. This is something that she used to say. Right chick, wrong day. But you are Satan. So I'm talking to you, Jamila. I'm using your words back at you today. But I thank God that I live rent free in Jamila's head. I thank God that Jamila is exposing. Jamila get paid to talk about me, y'all. Jamila get a check every day. She talking about the people living paycheck to paycheck, but she living day check to day check. Jamila living day check to day check. Guess what? Off of talking about me. But before I go into exposing this witch, Satan, Jamila, right chick? Roshana is the right chick. Roshana is the right chick. But today, March the 2nd, Tuesday, the day that we fasting and praying on behalf of the lost and unlearned people that you deceiving. God's morning, bless the sister uh, T. Today is the wrong day. Right chick, wrong day. Not today, Jamila. Right chick, wrong day. But I thank God. I thank God that you is you go to sleep thinking about me. You wake up thinking about me. You beefing, I'm exposing. It's a difference. You beefing as a real pastor. You beefing as a real pastor, so-called, with me every day, and I'm exposing you and you mad. Day check to day check, balls. You getting a day check to day check off of talking about me. I got to give y'all. Let me show y'all. Let's talk. Let, let, let's look at this, y'all. Let's look at what the witch did today. This is in a message today. This is why I'm here. I supposed to be up here talking about the ministry and what we do. I supposed to be giving y'all an update on the ministry and giving y'all the news about truth, circle of love. But guess what? The Holy Spirit said, what? The Holy Spirit said, tap into you. Clock in. Hit the clock. The Holy Spirit said, hit the clock. Hit the clock right now. Ain't no time to wait. Hit the clock, y'all. Listen. I'm always working in God's kingdom. Whether I'm working to help these people get delivered and set free from God by doing this exposing assignment, or I'm working, getting things together for us to go out and, and give to those that are in need. I'm always working. I told y'all I work for God. Right, chick? Totally wrong day. Totally wrong day today, sis. Totally wrong day. So let's get into, okay, let's get into, no, let's get into this. I got to show y'all the proof. Y'all already know I'm coming with the proof. I got to come with the proof. I got to come with the proof first. I got to come with the proof first. Okay. Hold on. I got to see which one it is. Oh, I know I put it. I just put it in the group. So I'm going to go to the group page to do it. Because I don't want to tap into the wrong one. I just put it in the group. Okay. I'm just going to start. This is the. I'm just going to start y'all off with this. I'm just going to start. It's a whole bunch of stuff that I can red flag on this Tuesday. But I'm going to. This the red flag. This the red flag that 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 proves that I really. Wow, Charlie girl crazy. She been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it. You do. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's it. 
She said, wow, child, that girl crazy. She been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You'll get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, Wow, child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, it, Hold on, y'all. She said, Wow, child. She said, Wow, child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. Child, that girl crazy. Child, that girl crazy. Jezebel calling somebody else a Jezebel. Who? Who? Who that was for? How they say it now? Who is for? Who is for? Who is it for? Who was this for? This today. Never mind what she did on Sunday when she got in it. Who is this for? Hold on. Let's see. Oh, look. She said, wow. Child, that girl crazy. She been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. Child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. Tell the truth, Jamila, shame yourself. You is the devil. Tell the truth, shame yourself. You are the devil. Satan, right chick, wrong day. Who is this for? Who is this for? Who is this for? Who is for? Who is for? Who is for? <laughs> it's safe to say that Jamila live, Jamila eat, Jamila sleep, Jamila S H I T, Shauna, Roshana, 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 Roshana. This is all that go through this lady head. Jamila is beeping with Roshana. Roshana is exposing Jamila. There is a difference. Do, 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 do. How she go? Tick, 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 tick. How she do for the stupid people? Tick, 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 How she do for the stupid people? Tick, 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 tick. That's how she do when they she know they stupid. Jamila, the wanna be real pastor of the world. C C M U C I. She beefing with Roshana. Roshana is exposing Jamila. Roshana is not beefing with Jamila. Roshana is exposing Jamila. Jamila is beefing with Roshana. Tick, 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 tick. If these stupid fools can get this through their head, tell the truth. Shame yourself because you are the devil. Tell the people the truth, Jamila. Shame yourself. Satan, right chick, wrong day. I'm trying to figure out. I'm just trying to figure out. If I was lying, 
We just going to say, even though we know we, I'm not. If I was lying, if I was lying on Jamila, if what I was saying about Jamila, if what I am speaking about Jamila and showing about Jamila is a lie, why is she so worried about it? Why is she so worried about the lies? A lie cannot affect nothing. It's the truth that can affect. You can't expose nobody with a lie. You cannot expose nobody with a lie. Because when you are exposing, you are exposing them because of what they lying about. You exposing with the truth. Hallelujah. You expose with the truth. You can't expose with a lie. I enjoy seeing for the last two years, six months, that Jamila has not talked about nothing. But Roshana, jealousy, envy, haters. Somebody ain't got no oil. The hate group. The hate group. Now. I've been calling you Jezebel Jamila for two years. You Jezebel and your husband is Ahab. So you mean to tell me on today, March the 2nd, 2024, you want to call me, I mean, April the 2nd, 2024, you want to call me Jezebel? I said March the 2nd earlier too. Y'all correct me. Charge that to my head, not my heart. Today is April the 2nd. I'm not living in March no more. We are in April. I've been calling Jamila Jezebel for two years since I've been exposing her. And you mean to tell me she gonna turn around and call me a Jezebel today? Let's see it. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so she said, Wow, child that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It it, it it's it. I tried to told y'all. I tried to told y'all from the beginning of this exposing assignment. Jamila is not a prophet. So if you are insinuating, and that's the only thing that I can get out of this stupid stuff. If you are insinuating, Jamila, that I am Jezebel, that I am crazy, she's talking about me. Jason, she's talking about me, so-called. You are so mad, Jamila, that the Holy Spirit got me exposing you to where you are a so-called pastor. Jamila is supposed to be ministering to the people. But obviously, see, when I think I was on the live, I didn't see nobody say nothing about Roshana. Jamila seen me in the comments, and she know that the people see me typing in the comments this morning. The people see me coming in caps in the comments, and she seen it too. That's why she said, don't worry about that girl. Nobody put my name in the comments. Jamila seen me commenting. That's why she said, that girl crazy. She got the spirit of Jezebel. She want to kill the prophet. First of all, I'm not no girl. I'm a woman. A real woman. I am not no girl, first of all, Jamila. Second of all, I am not crazy. I am not mental. Third of all, yes, I have been here exposing you for years. Yes, I have. Because the Spirit told me to. With evidence and proof. Speaking the truth. Yes, I have. I'm not no Jezebel. And I'm definitely not trying to kill no prophet. But last but not least, you're not no prophet anyway. You're not a prophet. You're not a pastor. You're not a prophetess. You're a witch. You're an online cult leader. That's what you is. Hey, Tijuana. I'm not no Jezebel. God ordained me to expose Jamila. That's why she started stuttering. Because she knew 
She was talking. I, her flesh is a mess, y'all. I wouldn't sit up under no so-called pastor and sow on no money on no scripture daily for her to be beefing with nobody that's weighed in Texas. Jamila is all bark, no bite. And I'm not even trying to fight. I find it so funny that she said I'm trying to kill the prophet, but she the one that walk around and talk about she a pistol packing pastor. Oh, she want me to die. Oh, she want the Holy Spirit to cut our, um, stop us from breathing. Jamila, you sitting up too many word curses, baby. You sit there, you, girl, you couldn't be filled with the Holy Spirit if you wanted to. If you wanted to be filled with the Holy Spirit, you couldn't. Your flesh is a mess and your flesh is in your way. You are a reprobate. And everybody that follow you is a reprobate. It's only a handful of people that are going to truly be delivered and set free by the Son of God from Jamila. The most of the people, they going straight to hell. Because they sitting there paying. They paying Jamila to be with me. And I'm sitting over here giving y'all a free game, exposing Jamila for free. And Jamila over there deceiving the people for a fee. Up there every morning beefing. Coming for Roshana. Talking about Roshana. Why? Because I live free. I live rent free in her head. I got condos in her head. I live rent free in Jamila's brain. Jamila is not just stupid. Jamila is not just crazy. Jamila is not just evil. Jamila is not just wicked. Jamila is deranged. Jamila is psychotic. Jamila really... Let me tell y'all something. The most dangerous person... To be around is a person that lies and believe they own lies. The most dangerous person that you can ever be around is a deceiver. And Jamila is a deceiver. Jamila is a deceiver of herself. Thank you, Holy Spirit, because this is not in my notes. The Holy Spirit is telling me to say these things, what I'm saying right now. Jamila is a deceiver. She is a deceiver of herself first. Because Jamila then lied and told the world that God called her to pastor the nation. And Jamila believed that lie. That is the most dangerous person that you can be around. It's dangerous to be around a deceiver. But a deceiver that deceives themselves as well as others. Yeah. I think I'll take... um. I think I'll take purple. I think I'm going to do my living room in, in, in my condo that's in Jamila head. I think I'm going to do my living room purple since purple signifies royalty. I think I'm going to get some purple um, curtains with a white shimmer um, one in the middle. I'm going to have a white um, lounge couch with the little thing so I, with the footstool because the spirit, the God said that he would... Um, let my enemies be my footstool. So I'm going to get a white um, living room set. I ain't got no children anyway. Um, sis, I want some purple curtains. I'm going to get a purple throw rug. Give me some little purple accents. But the furniture is going to be white. And I need a white stool. Oh, that's, yeah, that's going to be, it's going to be beautiful. Yes, it is. I, I might as well, I might as well deck it out. I might as well deck it out. I'm living rent free in the head anyway. I ain't got to pay no rent. I might as well deck the little apartment out. I got to deck the condo out, y'all. I have to deck this condo out in Jamila's head. I, I, I'm going to use my own money, though. I'm not going to deceive nobody for no money to do this, okay? I'm living rent-free, so I might as well use my funds to, to decorate the way I want to decorate. <laughs> she said, I have a purple Bible. It's written in. But very love, you can have it for your living room. Thank you, um, daughter. Yes, I need that purple Bible. I'll make you a registry at the same place as the baby registry. Yes, please do that, y'all. Sis, make me a registry at the same place that the baby registry is at. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm going to need purple curtains. I'm going to need a purple um, throw rug. I'm going to need some white shimmer. I want some cute little pictures. Y'all y'all just, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be real, real nice. I, I live there anyway. I live there rent-free. If I'm going to live there rent-free, I got to be comfortable. I got to be comfortable. If I'm going to live in Jamila's head rent-free, I got to be comfortable. I want a cute little white um footstool, and I'm going to get a purple throw so I can put my feet up and, and prop it. I, I might as well relax. I live rent-free there. I, 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 I live rent-free. I don't have to pay no rent. I 
I live rent free, so I might as well deck the place out and just go and get comfortable living there. Right? I might as well just go and get I purple. Yep, you know I love butterflies. You know, that's right. That can be the pictures, niece. The butterflies, I, you know I love butterflies. Listen, purple butterflies, royalty. Listen, I might as well. I might as well get comfortable there. I live there rent free anyway. Get comfortable, sis. You're gonna be there for a while. I, I listen. She, I live rent free, so I, I, I can't get put out. I can't get put out. It's so funny. See, the spirit told me to tell Jamila, tell the truth, shame yourself. See, the saying is, tell the truth, shame the devil. <laughs> the saying is, tell the truth, shame the devil. But the Holy Spirit had me write, Jamila, tell the truth, shame yourself. The Holy Spirit told me to tell Jamila, tell the truth, shame yourself. Because she is the devil. I, Roshana, those of y'all that don't know who Jamila is talking about daily, because she talks about me daily. Jamila talks about me without talking about me. And that's what I like. You know what I'm saying? I'm not, I don't, I don't have that type of energy. I can't be talking about nobody standing behind a bush. I can't be talking about nobody standing behind the door. I can't be talking about nobody standing behind the platform without saying their name. No, I was in her comments. I was up. I was up this morning typing in caps. That's why y'all seen me doing all of that. Ain't nobody say that. She seen me typing. And she knew that everybody else seen it too. That's why she responded to it. She responded to the typing. That's all it could have been. I was on there typing in caps. Telling the people. Nobody said my name. If they did, it was I didn't see it. You know how she do. She got to make a fool out of herself. She got to mention me, Jamila. See, let me share something with y'all. And it, what I'm going to say is going to make a lot of sense. Jamila always say the stuff she say makes sense, but it don't. Listen, that's why she was mad. Yes, daughter. Let me tell y'all something. If Jamila... She saw your comments. Yes, she did. If Jamila would just stop watching these lives, she'll be better off. Now, that's using wisdom. I watch the little stuff that I watch so that I can screen record, so that I can expose. And I got something bigger to expose. I just got to get to it. I got something bigger that Jamila exposed. Today, Jamila exposed herself on a whole nother level today. I've been telling y'all that it's an online court organization. I've been telling y'all that it's man-made. Jamila the one who said, go at this, go at all of this, go. I've been telling y'all that it's man-made. That she did this all. And she proved it today. Jamila spoke something today that she shouldn't have never said. Jamila spoke something today that she shouldn't have never said. And I'm ready to say it, but the Holy Spirit said, hold off, because guess what? When I when y'all hear Jamila say what she said today, the whole world. Van Wisdom say I was up in that thing today too. <laughs> the whole when I say what she said today, y'all, the whole world gonna say, huh? I thought you said God, huh? When I let y'all hear what Jamila said today. Exposing herself big time. I ain't even got in my notes. I know this live gonna do good. I know this live gonna be good, and I know this live gonna do good in numbers to God be the glory. I ain't even got on my notes yet. I ain't even started reading the notes. When I let y'all hear Jamila expose herself, it went over the fools' heads. It went over their head like a rainbow. Jamila exposing that she was a cult leader, letting these words come out of her mouth. That stuff went over the people's head like a rainbow. Pew. Pew. They so stupid. They don't, listen, they so stupid. 
Them people over there are so stupid. Jamila says something so profound. And it ain't nothing but the Holy Spirit. Let me tell y'all something. And this is nothing but the Spirit. Anytime that Jamila didn't say it, Roshana, she was not intending to say Roshana. God made her say Roshana. And the Holy Spirit spoke this to me last night. Anytime that Jamila didn't say my name, when she act like she was, it was somebody else and she tried to change it. When she said Roshana Johnson, that's a demon. When she said, oh, Roshana, I hate that name. All three times that Jamila has said my name. She didn't do it on purpose. She didn't have no control over it. God made Jamila say my name. So that the fools that follow her would know it wasn't by accident. It wasn't by coincidence. It was God. God made Jamila say my name. Not one time. Not two times. But three. And the reason why the Holy Spirit told me that is because now I'm you. When she talking to me, I'm you. When she talking about me, I'm she. When she talking to me like she got in the screen and she said, you wasting your time, she's talking to Roshana. She's too cowardly to say my name. The only time she done said my name is when the Holy Spirit didn't made her say my name, even though he don't reside in her. God made her say my name so that the world is recorded. She cannot say that she didn't say my name. God did that, not Jamila. And the reason why I'm saying that is because the Holy Spirit showed me this last night. She said my name three times. Not one, not two, but three. She said it once for the Father in heaven. She said once for his son, Jesus Christ, who resurrected. And she said it once for the Holy Spirit. But the Holy Trinity allowed her to say it so that the world would know. I say Jamila name boldly. I'm not hiding behind no platform talking about nobody without saying their name. I'm not hiding behind no dough talking about nobody without saying their name. I'm not hiding behind no bush talking about nobody without saying their name. Because ain't nothing coward about me. I walk in the boldness. That God has given me and instilled in me. If I didn't walk in this boldness, I wouldn't be exposing Jamila. God gave me this assignment to expose Jamila because he knew that he had trained me up to be able to, to do. For this very reason. For this very reason. And people always want to compare. Oh, God ain't tell me this. God, let me tell y'all something. God give you assignments Based off of your qualities. If you're not qualified. If you are not qualified to do what God is calling you to do. He don't give that assignment to somebody else. Nobody was qualified to expose Jamila but who? And I'm 33 minutes into this assignment. And this is the Holy Spirit speaking. I'm 33 minutes into this live. And the Holy Spirit is speaking. 333. 33. 33. 333. 33 minutes, 33 seconds. And the Holy Spirit, I qualified to receive this assignment. God gave me this assignment because you know why? God had got me ready. He prepared me. He allowed me to be in front of Jamila. Because he knew that I was bold enough. I didn't know who God, Jamila was when I was around Jamila when I prayed. But God did. God knew who Jamila was. I didn't. When I prayed to be in front of sinner with the witch. Without knowing she was a witch. God answered my prayers and made it happen. And I was in her presence several times. Not just no little. And I thank God for these last six months of receipts. That is going to prove. Y'all finna see me and Jamila dancing. Oh, I'm a demon. I'm a Jezebel now. Oh, but you a prophet. If Jamila was a prophet, what Jamila said about me today, I'm a Jezebel and I'm trying to kill a prophet. Jamila would have been knew that about me if she was a real pastor. If you was a real prophet. 
Obviously, I knew something was up with her for me to pray and be to be front and center with her. Obviously, I knew something was up with her. Obviously, I knew something was up with her if I prayed to be front and center with her. God answered my prayers. I told y'all, my prayers don't go up and hit the ground. They go up and they fall down on somebody's shoulders. So that prayer that I put in up to the throne of grace to be front and center with Jamila, guess what? It went up and God let it fall back on my shoulders. And that's why I was in your presence. Jamila don't have no control of nothing that I experienced with her. God gets all the glory. The credit goes all the way back to the creator. It's just, I'm telling you, it's the truth. God allowed every single thing to happen. The Bible tells us with God, all things are possible. With man, nothing is. So me being around Jamila, me being around Jamila, why she ain't slay me? Why she ain't touch me? You know why she ain't touch me? And I'm going to say the same thing I said when I started this exposing assignment. You know why Jamila couldn't touch me? Jamila couldn't touch me because the spirit of God is in me, but the fire of God is on me. If Jamila would have touched me, Jamila wouldn't have been able to play church. Jamila wouldn't have been able to play church. Jamila would not have been able to pretend that she was a pastor this long. If Jamila would have touched me as far as talking about laying hands. If Jamila would have touched me as far as talking about laying hand and prophesying to me in my ear and touching me, she wouldn't have lasted this long plan. Because the spirit of God lives in me, but the fire of God is on me. If you touch me, if you touch me, you can't play with God. It's, I said this coming in. We love you too, um, Van Wisdom. She could not have did it. That's why those of y'all that know when I was there, Jamila stayed out. Jamila serenaded. Oh, unstoppable. You're unstoppable. You got the spirit of John the Baptist, Roshana. You're unstoppable. You're unstoppable. Unstoppable. You got the spirit of John the Baptist, Roshana. You are in your zeal, your anointed, unstoppable. Jamila serenaded me. When I was in the presence of Jamila, Jamila serenaded me from afar. Jamila ain't never ran up on me, touching me. Everybody that's around was around me. Everybody that was around me, Jamila put them on the floor. She put them on the floor, put them on the floor, not me. Anybody that came around Jamila that was with me, Jamila touched them, got in their ear, put them on the ground, not me. She ain't never pushed me down. She ain't never touched my stomach. But everybody that came with me, guess what? She put them on the floor, 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 not me. She serenaded me, unstoppable. Oh, I love Roshana Zeal. Y'all better get with Roshana and get be a prayer partner. Roshana is traveling and she's staying with people. Y'all better get with Roshana. She gave me free promotion. You said my name on every single live that you did, Jamila, from the time I met you. From the time I met this witch in person, Jamila ain't stopped saying my name until I rebuked her after she told me I didn't sow enough. I speak facts. This is my testimony. Share me. Yes, ma'am. You can, Van Wisdom. Yes, ma'am. Hey, too good to be true. I can't make this stuff up. I live this. And that's why people, if people are mad about me telling my testimony, then they're going to stay mad. Because our testimonies is supposed to be told. That's why we be tested to have a testimony in order to testify. 
You can't testify without no testimony. You can't have a testimony if you wasn't tested. So guess what? I was tested. I'm telling my testimony through me testifying. To God be the glory. Let's see what the witch said. Yeah, let's see. I got to go back to it. Hold on. Try that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, this. <laughs> it, 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 it's, it. She who has believed. crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. Let's see this one more time. Did I? Try that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand that. They sure live going to get used to it. They going to get used to these truths. That's what she was telling them. Y'all going to get used to these truths. Y'all going to get used to these truths. That's what she telling y'all y'all going to get used to. She telling the people she, she ain't going nowhere. Y'all going to get used to it because she is telling the truth. Listen, Jamila, I said before you, because I know you're looking. I know you're watching. Thank you, Jamila, for giving me a penny or two with your views. You know what I'm saying? Because you one of the viewers, baby. So thank you for running it up for me. Run it up, run it up, run it up. Run it up, run it up, run it up. Tell the truth, shame yourself, Jamila. Tell the truth, shame yourself. Hey, Michelle. She said, go this morning, doggone it. Definitely need to check my notifications because I knew you would be breaking live today. You already know it. The lady called me uh, 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 Jezebel. She said I'm mental and she said I'm trying to kill the prophet. Who is the prophet? Who is, who is the prophet that I'm trying to kill? Listen. If y'all didn't know, y'all know now. Roshana lives rent-free in the so-called real pastor's head. Roshana lives rent-free in the so-called real pastor's head. I live rent-free in Jamila's head because everything Jamila talk about, she call it a message. Oh, yeah, she did. Break it live with Relentless Row. You already know. Oh, yeah, she did. But it's okay. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. So, for Jamila to be a real pastor, Jamila think this is like an in-the-street beef. I'm not beefing with nobody. I'm exposing Jamila. I don't have a problem with saying Jamila's name. I don't have a problem with exposing the things that the Holy Spirit tell me to expose because I'm not beefing with nobody. I don't get off of here and be on no phone talking about old Jamila this. I, uh, I talk about Jamila right here. <laughs> I talk about Jamila right here. I'm not on no phone talking about no Jamila. If y'all see me on the phone talking about Jamila, it's right here with Michelle Chappelle. Come on. This is what God called me to do. This is what God told me to do. I, 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 I'm not on no phone mad and all that like Jamila is. I'm not. That's why right. everybody crazy except her, but she the one that's really crazy. She's deranged. That's why I said she's deranged. She play reverse psychology. That's just like she get up there and talk about she got a gun. She like an AK this. She going to shoot, pow, pow, all of that. But then she turn around and say that I'm trying to kill the prophet. How I'm trying to kill the prophet? With the truth? You can't kill no prophet with the truth because the prophet comes and tell the truth. It's the deceivers that tell the lies. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You can't kill a prophet with the truth because the prophet speaks the truth. Hello? How you gonna kill the prophet? You can't kill the prophet with the truth. You can't kill the prophet with no truth. So you, you're not no prophet. Anyway. Jamila, you live. You eat. 
and you sleep. Roshana, Roshana, Roshana. I'm talking to you, Jamila. I say you live. You eat and you sleep. Roshana, Roshana, Roshana. No, 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 you don't have to justify. You don't have to just a lot. No, 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 no. We know that you're too cowardly. We know that you're too cowardly to say my name, say my name. I want you to say my name. Not with God making you say it. I want you to get on the live. I want you to get on the live, Jamila. And I just want you to say my name. Say my name, say my name. So they know you talking about me. You lying, saying I'm crazy. But you the one that's crazy. Say my name, say my name. So these fools can get free. Say my name. That's the song I made way from the beginning. Oh, it's about to go down. Yeah, it's shifting. It's shifting for my good. It's shifting for my good. Say my name. If you so boldly can get up there and say she, being on, say who she is. If you can so boldly to get up there and say she Jezebel, say who she is. If you so boldly to get up there to say she trying to kill the prophet, say who she is and say who the prophet is. Don't leave nobody no room for guessing. Don't leave no room for nobody to have to guess nothing. Nobody shouldn't be guessing who she is. Nobody shouldn't have been guessing who you was talking about on Sunday when you said you. Except the charity boxing challenge between CCM, UCI, and True Circle of Love. Except the challenge. Type or make a post and say it's on. Make a post and say it's on so the dream team behind the scenes can screenshot it and send it to me. And I know what's up. Say my name. When you talking about me, Jamila, can you please say my name? Stop being so cowardly. If you about it, be about it. If you not, shut up. If you about it, be about it. If you not about it, Jamila, just shut up. Because you're doing what the Holy Spirit said you would do. You exposing yourself. I'm not exposing you. I don't have, I'm not mad at you, Jamila. You mad at yourself. I'm exposing you, baby. I'm doing what Ephesians 5, 11 tell me to do. I had parts of your unfruitful works. I had parts of your darkness. And therefore, the Holy Spirit told me to expose it. So I'm calling you out on it. I'm calling you out on it. Yeah. If you so tough, toughy. You so bout it, toughy. Toughy. I'm going to call Jamila toughy. If you so tough, Jamila, be bold and say Roshana Johnson instead of saying Roshana Minosa. Be bold enough to say Roshana Johnson instead of saying Roshana Minosa. Say my name. Say my name. I made a whole song up when I first started this YouTube channel. And it goes a little something like this. It is to Jamila. Say my name, say my name, so they know you talking about me. You lying, saying I'm crazy, but you the one that's crazy. Say my name, say my name, so these fools can get free. I was saying people at first, but now I'm calling y'all fools. It's almost three years I've been sitting right here. I started out calling them people, lost and unlearned. But now the Holy Spirit said, call them fools. Because that's what they are. Did y'all hear Jamila on there today? Jamila was bold enough to call some lady a fool. Jamila say some lady was on um, social media eating food was coming out of her mouth. She was talking about, I'm going to die on Section 8. And she said, yeah, this fool, I'm going to call her that. You bold enough to call that lady a fool. But you ain't bold enough to say my name. 
You mean to tell me you bold enough to call that lady a fool, but you ain't bold enough to say my name? Say my name, say my name. So the fools can know who you're talking about. Say my name, say my name. You say I'm crazy, but you the one who's crazy. Say my name, say my name. So those fools can get free, Jamila. Say it. Say Roshana Johnson is exposing me. Now that's the truth. Say Roshana Johnson was once up under me. I loved her zeal. She was so smart. She was such a genius. She did a lot for my ministry. I gave her free promotion. She was my ride or die. I loved her zeal. I loved her anointing. I spoke very highly of her until she rebuked me. Say that because that's the truth. Say that. And then you'll be telling the truth. If you say anything other, you're lying. Jamila is the one that's crazy, y'all. Pretending to be a real pastor of the world. Lying saying that God told you to warn, comfort, and correct the world. Lying saying that the Holy Spirit got you telling these people to sow on scripture. That's crazy. Now, that's crazy. That, that's deranged. Because if you believe your own lies, that makes you deranged. That makes you obsessed with lying. Jamila is a habitual liar. Jamila is a habitual liar, meaning that she lied just to lie. And she believed her own lies. Crazy is pretending to be a real pastor. Crazy is lying to deceive the people for their money. Crazy is being married five different times and you ain't but 52. Crazy is set, telling the people that you was finna take your own life. Crazy is standing on the so-called pulpit telling another woman of God that you're gonna kick her butt. Crazy is going viral because you can't control your temper. Now that's crazy. Jamila is crazy for pretending to be a real pastor for a penny. Crazy is not the word for you, Jamila. Deranged is. I know I said I wasn't going to come up here this morning talking about no Jamila because I was going to be talking about the ministry. But guess what? Why lie? I'm here. The Holy Spirit said do this. I do what the Holy Spirit say do. Last night I started writing my notes for the ministry. This morning I had to get up and write notes. For this, I'm always working. Because as soon as the Holy Spirit say do something, this is what I do. Jamila sit there and tell me she got uh, tablets and, and stuff all around her. But Jamila lying. Roshana got tablets and tablets and tablets. Two years, six months worth of tablets of writing. Plus the ones I was writing before. The Holy Spirit said get up here this morning. Exposed and addressed. The lies of Jamila. The Holy Spirit said, get up here this morning. Expose and address. I'm exposing Jamila to y'all. But I'm addressing Jamila too because she watches these lives. It's very obvious Jamila watched the lives. It ain't no way around it. Anybody that think that Jamila don't watch these lives, y'all got to be the dumbest of the dumb. Because she wouldn't be able to respond Ain't nobody running back telling Jamila nothing. Jamila is watching. And that's what I said. That's how you know she deranged. Because the more she watch, the more she gonna expose. When she stop watching, but that's too much like right for her. Because she messy. If she was to stop watching, she wouldn't be exposing herself so much. Because you listening to me and getting up here answering questions, repeating what I'm saying, copying what I'm saying, mimicking what I'm saying. I told y'all a long time ago, Jamila is them fool's leader and I'm Jamila the fool leader. Expose and address. Expose so the people can get it, but address the witch face to face. Woman to witch. Because she watch them. And when Jamila watch these lives, I can only imagine how she is.
No, she said 27. Oh, someone said that's nothing to do 77. She didn't say 57 today. She said 77. I was on the van. She said 27 years. Oh, somebody said, can they do um uh that's not nothing. Oh, you can do 77 because it's a double blessing or whatever. She didn't say 57 today. She said 77. 27 is 77. But I was already in the comments. That's the first comment I made this morning. How much? Yeah, I was on there. That's the first comment I made on there. How much y'all put? What is the price tag? I said, what is the price tag for today? $27. I said that coming on when she first was starting. This lady is so pressed about you, my Lord. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. But she's only pressed because she know that I was around her. She know, y'all, it's a lot of stuff that I haven't even exposed. I got to wait. for. Listen, I got to wait. I got to save some of these receipts for my movie. It's a documentary. It's going to be a documentary. And for the books. It's a lot of stuff. Jamila's sitting over there walking on eggshells. Because it's a whole bunch of stuff that I can expose in her household that she shared with me. So, she, you know what I'm saying? I would tell her to tread lightly, but she not because she's going to troll over here every time I go live. I would tell you to tread lightly, Jamila, but you're not because you're going to troll over here. So it ain't no sense of me telling you to tread lightly when you're going to troll. Expose and address is what the Holy Spirit said. Expose and address is what Jamila says. She know you all the truth. That's right, Lakeisha. She know it. And, 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 and she is very, she is so scared. That's why she got up there and said, I was scared. No, the real person that's scared is her. I don't have nothing to be scared of. Jamila is the one that's doing all this illegal stuff. I don't have no reason to be scared. You know what I'm saying? I ain't did nothing. The feds not watching me. The feds watching Jamila. So what am I being scared for? I ain't did nothing against nobody. I ain't did nothing to the IRS. I ain't deceived nobody. I ain't misused no so-called church funds. I ain't robbed nobody. I ain't killed nobody. I ain't did none of them things. So what I'm going to be scared for, Jamila's scared of this exposing assignment, exposing her, and her losing her, her empire. I'm going to say that. I'm going to put the word out there. She's scared that these truths and this proof is going to make her lose her empire that she built. That empire that she built, CCMUCI, that's the empire that she built. Huh? What? What? Huh? 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 She said she built this empire because she's smart. Huh? Huh? What? She said she's smart. She built this empire. Oh. Did somebody else hear that? Oh. I'm just... Did anybody hear her say she's smart? She built this empire. Arlene say she built it all right because God did not. That's right, Arlene. But did anybody hear her say that today? Because that's a red flag. Did anybody hear her say that today? Oh, I did too, Arlena. Did, did anybody else on here? Oh, Van Wisdom said she did too. Is it anybody else that's on here that heard her say she's smart? I, I, I built this empire. Just like that. But what did God do? That's right. Smart like a dog knob. Did anybody hear that? Do, do I need to show them? Do I need to show... I need... Do I need to show proof that she said that? I mean, I speak the proof, I speak the truth, but I also show the proof. So y'all know if I'm saying that, then I got proof of her saying that, right? How many 
people in the comments heard Jamila say she's smart. I built this empire. Yeah, she said something about interfering with somebody like Hood. Ro, you never get tired. Hey, Audra. Okay, hold on. Hold on, y'all. When they was kids, they was always getting sick home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they married me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sick home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they married me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care. I'm looking it up for... She gonna be on here. She ain't gotta look it up. I'm finna look it up for her and explain it. So my thing is, do you have a ministry, a church, or empire? Boasted. Oh, she boasted, baby. I picked up the pride immediately. The Bible says pride comes before a fall. That's right. Lord, not a ministry, but an empire. Yep. Mm-hmm. 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 Empire. An empire, the first one it says, the definition of empire. An extensive group of states or countries under a single supreme authority, formerly, especially an emperor or empress. Things that are similar to an empire is a kingdom, a realm. A domain, 
a territory, a province, commonwealth, federation, confederation, power, world power, superpower, jurisdiction, a large commercial organization owned or controlled by one person or group. Jamila just exposed herself and I'm going to come back with that one. That's going to be a whole nother live. The Holy Spirit just told me I will be doing a live. What's the difference between an empire, a ministry, and a church? Boom. Jamila just let the world know. I told y'all the world was going to go. I thought you don't try to control. But if you built an empire, you so smart you built an empire. A large commercial organization owned or controlled by one person. Jamila is the one person that controls her empire, her cult empire, CCM, UCI. Jamila is the one person that controls this empire. This is not a church. This is not a ministry. I have been screaming it for two years. Empire. CCM, UCI, that's Jamila's cult empire. That is her large commercial organization, which is owned and controlled by Jamila, that one person. Fred can leave the day or tomorrow. She's still going to have that cult empire. Fred can leave today or tomorrow. And Jamila going to still have what? Her empire. Mm-mm-mm. This is good. This is good. Jamila says she's smart. She's so smart that she built an empire. I'm smart. I'm a genius. But I ain't smart enough to start this exposing assignment. I had to wait on the Lord. I had to wait on the Lord to give me this exposing assignment. I'm very smart, born a genius, straight A's. I'm, I'm very smart. Okay, Arna, I love you. Love you from Texas to Romania, Anna. Listen, I've been trying to tell y'all CCM wasn't no ministry. I've been trying to tell y'all UCI wasn't no church. Jamila said it today. Let's, let's hear it. I think I want to hear it again. Since she so boldly said it, I think I want to hear it again. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. Shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm very smart. <laughs> Built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy when they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. Shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm very smart. <laughs> Built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit, when they was kids, they was always getting sent home. She said, Wow, child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, wow, 
child. Child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You'll get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, Wow, child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, Wow, child, that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, it, Y'all, I have to stay on topic. I really would love to talk about that empire, but I'll be up in the morning with that one because I'm going to write notes about this empire stuff. I'm going to break it down to the simplest of compound. But right now, I have to continue to talk to Jamila about what she's saying right here about me. She woke up with my name on her brain again because I live free. I live rent-free in her head. Jamila, and this is me addressing Jamila. I told y'all I come to expose and address because that's what the Holy Spirit said. So the Holy Spirit got me in my notes. And in my notes, I'm addressing Jamila. Jamila. As a real so-called pastor of the world, I have a few questions that I would love to ask you. Because I'm not understanding how could you be pastoring the world, but you constantly... Talk about me incognito. You won't say my name. You just talk, 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 talk. So now that the Holy Spirit have me addressing you, I want to ask you this. Are you, Jamila, are you going to continue to watch me expose you? Are you going to continue to watch my lives? Are you going to continue to watch me expose you? Are you going to continue to make yourself mad by sitting there listening and seeing me speak the truth and show the proof? Are you going to continue to watch the lives? Are you going to continue to tune into the lives? I'm addressing this because these are things that I need to know so that I can know how to come on my platform. Are you going to continue? To watch me expose you. Are you going to continue to respond. To what I ask you. During the exposing. Are you going to continue to come up here. And copy. My little sayings. Mimic. What I say. Are you going to continue to answer the questions that I ask you. Are you going to continue to acknowledge me every day instead of acknowledging the Holy Trinity? Is all of your mess? Because they are not messages. Is all of your mess that you get up there every day going to be about Roshana? Without you saying Roshana? I'm addressing you, Jamila. Is all of your mess that you call messages, all of your morning lives, all of your inside of the storefront building, is all of this going to continue to be about Roshana without you saying Roshana's name, but constantly saying hate group? You always talking about a hate group. Are you going to constantly talk about the hate group without telling the people who you call in the hate group? Are you going to constantly beat with me in private without telling the people that you beefing with me because I'm exposing you? These are some questions that I need you to answer. You answering questions anyway. Are you mad that God got me exposing you? Are you really, really mad because I'm um, promoting Sabina's book? Are you mad because you know Fred don't love you because he never loved Sabina? I just need to know, are you mad? What is you so mad about? Why are you mad at Roshana? What did Roshana do to you? What did Roshana do to you? For you to change it from her being so anointed to her being a lunatic. What did Roshana do to you? That's the question. <laughs> 
What did Roshana do to you to make you talk about Roshana every day? What did she do? Can you tell me what Roshana did? You steady telling the people something about a hate group without telling the fools that you beefing with somebody. You trying to include beef into some type of message that's supposed to be for God. God is not the author of confusion nor mess. You are. You enticing, encouraging people that is up under your demonic soul tie to beef with people that they don't even know. Can you at least tell the people who they beefing with? Can you lead them over here to the relentless road, breaking live, God ordained, exposing assignments? Can you do that? Listen, I'm talking to you, Jamila. I'm talking to Jamila Young Davis Jenkins Weeks. Good. No, Mitchell. Miss Mitchell. I am talking to uh, Miss Mitchell on this paper. I am talking to you, Jamila Young Davis Jenkins Weeks Mitchell. Now, good. I am talking to Jamila Young, maiden name, Davis, first husband, kid's father, Jenkins, second husband, Weeks. Third husband, Mitchell, fourth husband, now good and on the fifth fool. I'm talking straight to you. I'm talking straight to you. I'm not talking about you. I'm not talking around you. I'm not talking over you. I'm not talking in, uh, under you. I'm talking about you. Where there is no confusion. Nobody have to assume who I'm talking about. Nobody have to assume who God had me exposing because God told me to speak your name. And until God tells me to stop, guess what? I am going to be saying Jamila, Young, Davis, um, Jenkins, um, Weeks, Mitchell, now Gooden. I'm going to say your name with boldness and with authority. It ain't no allegedly over here. Get your lawyer. I want to talk to him. Get the police. I want to talk to him. Get the feds. I want to talk to him. Get North Carolina Attorney General. I want to talk to him. I want to talk to everybody. I, I told y'all this is the season. I want to talk. I'm ready to talk. I already didn't start talking. I'm typing. Attorney Generals. I'm talking to you. I'm exposing you by talking about you. You are the topic of my everyday discussion. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. Jamila with the five husbands married to that fool, Fred the fool, the good and the third. You are the topic to my everyday discussion because God ordained me to expose you. I'm not over here talking. You talk about everybody, but you talk about me daily. You talk about everything that go on in the world. I'm talking about you. You are the topic of my discussion every day. Because God told me to expose you with evidence. Truth plus proof. Equals my testimony. Truth plus proof. Equals my testimony with you, Jamila. It's funny how you want me to be Jezebel. It's funny how you want me to be mental. But it's more funny that you would put and say the words that I'm trying to kill the prophet. How? You are not a prophet. The truths and proof that the people get over here was ordained by God. My concern is the souls and salvation of the lost and unlearned fools that follow you. Your concern is their money. You lie and you rob over them. I speak truth and show proof over here. I said you lie, Jamila, and you rob the people over there on your YouTube. Over here, I speak the truth 
and I show the proof. You rob and you lie. That's what y'all do over there. Over here, I speak the truth and show the proof for free. Jamila, besides you being mad that I am telling your truth that you did not tell by showing proof of your mistakes, you exposing yourself just like the Holy Spirit told me that you would do on September the 9th, 2021, by making everything about me. The so-called pastor of the nation ain't bold and brave enough to call your name. No, she's not. You are exposing yourself just like the Holy Spirit said you was. And I came in here speaking. Everything that I speak, it has manifested. Everything that I have spoken concerning this exposing assignment besides Jamila going to jail, and that's coming. Those are the only two things. Jamila going to hell. Go, Jamila going to jail. Hell to the lake of fire. Those are the only things that have not manifested. Everything else has manifested. And to God be the glory. Because I speak what the Holy Spirit tell me to speak. I'm spirit led to be spirit fed. I don't have to get up here and, 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 and give myself no title. God has already given me a title. I got several of them. I don't get up here and boast and brag in them. I don't walk around saying I'm this. I don't walk around saying I'm that. I walk around being spirit led and spirit fed. When I speak, you will see it. When I speak, it will manifest because it is the spirit of God and the spirit speaks the truth. You exposing yourself. Ro, a friend of a friend want to know, can you ask Jamila, when will it sink in her that she is a cult leader and not a pastor? She's, she believe all her lies. It'll never sink in. She going to the lake of fire believing she's a pastor. Now make that make sense. She already said she going to hell. She said it herself. Jamila, with the five husbands, I just want to let you know you making a fool out of yourself. You want me to be looking like a fool because I'm exposing you because people think you're a real pastor, but you're not. And that's all going to come to pass. God is going to reveal that to the world. Just like you deceiving the world, your downfall has to be worldwide because you expose, I mean, you deceiving people worldwide. You exposing yourself big time by making everything about me. Jamila, you making money daily by beefing with me without the world knowing that you deceiving them daily for a fee. Jamila get up there and be in rare form like she was today. And then at the end, she asked the people to give $27. Some people say that ain't much due to double 77. Begging early in the week. You know why? Because it's the registry for the baby. They need gifts. The baby about to be born in the next couple of days. A global downfall. Her global deceiving. Her global deceiving is going to bring her global downfall. I had to write that down. That's going to come with this empire. That's something that I can talk about. It. Thank you, Sister Michael. That's something that I can include with the empire message. I just told you why you the topic of my discussion because God ordained me to expose you. But Jamila, can you tell me why I am the topic of your discussion? Why am I, why am I the topic of your everyday mess? Why am I the topic of your everyday mess? If you're going to make me the topic of your everyday mess, I think you need to say my name. I think the people need to know who she is. Stop referring to me as you. Stop referring to me as she. Stop referring to me as hate group. Say Roshana. You already said you hate the name anyway. You might as well say you hate the person because you act like you do. You want to, but you really love the person that I am. To God be the glory. Jamila, 
I'm giving you a chance to speak up or forever hold your peace. And I'm not talking about hold your gun. Jamila, I'm giving you a chance publicly to speak up now or forever hold your peace. And I'm not talking about the pistol. I'm not talking about your AK. I'm not talking about the pistol that you keep in your purse because you're a pistol-packing pastor. I'm not talking about that piece, my dear. I'm not talking about that piece, my dear. I'm talking about your sense of peace. Speak up now or forever hold your peace. I'm not talking about your pistol, my dear. Stop referring to me as she. Stop referring to me as you. Stop referring me to uh, as hate group. My name is Roshana Michelle Johnson. Roshana Michelle Provost is my legal name. But Roshana Michelle Johnson is my name. Stop referring to me as you. Stop referring to me as she. Stop referring to me as hate group. Stop referring to me as men mental. Stop referring to me as being Jezebel. Say my name. You ain't have a problem saying it when you said Mimosa. You ain't have a problem saying it when you was up there saying that, oh, not Roshana Johnson, that's a demon. You ain't have no problem saying that, oh, Roshana, I hate that name. You know why you ain't have no problem? Because you ain't have no control of it. You ain't have no control of them three times you said my name. You said my name three, and everybody in the world know my, my number is three. You said one for the Father, one for the Son, and one for the Holy Spirit. Thank you. Thank you, Holy Trinity, for making us say it. If she calls herself exposing you, she needs to say your name. Yeah. She beefing with me. I'm exposing her. She's not trying to expose me. There's nothing to expose. You can't expose, you can't expose something that ain't nothing to expose. I done told all my truths. Why am I the topic of your everyday mess that you call a message? Why you talk about me? Oh, you. You scared, not me. Why you know she? She been on there. Oh, the hate group. Why you talk about me? She. You. Hate group. Speak up now, witch. Or forever hold your peace. Speak up now, witch. Or forever hold your peace. And no, my dear, because that's who you're looking like. Tyler Perry, my dear. No, my dear. I'm not talking about your iron piece. I'm not talking about your AK. I'm not talking about your pistol. I know you say you're a pistol packet pastor and all of this here. I'm not talking about that piece. I'm talking about your peace of mind. Something that you don't have right now. Speak up. Or forever hold your peace. Something that you don't got. You right. My bad sis. She beefing you exposing. She ain't going to call your name because you got receipts. She say she got receipts. She ain't showed not now yet. Five years. I'm sure all the ones she got is the ones I got too. And some of the ones that I ain't showed. I got a question. And I'm finna have to play this so I can let y'all see. I just need to. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's a spirit of Isabel. You get used to it, you do. She has a spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the She said, Wow. Try that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's a spirit of Jezebel. You get used to it, you do. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's it. She said, wow, try that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You'll get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, wow, try that girl crazy. She's been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You'll get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it. She said, wow, 
Child, that girl crazy. She been on there for years. You get used to it. She's a mental case. She's the spirit of Jezebel. You'll get used to it, you too. She has the spirit of Jezebel. She wants to kill the prophet. Hold on. And so, therefore, understand this. It, 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 it's, it... Jamila, who is the she that is trying to kill the prophet? We we got questions now. You 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 up here publicly on here. We trying to we try before I call my lawyer and try I'm trying to find out who you're talking about first. Who is the she that is trying to feel that is trying to kill the prophet, Jamila? Who is the she that is trying to kill the prophet? Who is Jezebel besides whom proves that they are Jezebel herself, which is you? Who is she that is trying to kill the prophet, Jamila? That's the first question. Who is Jezebel besides yourself and you prove it? Most importantly, who is the prophet that she is trying to kill? I got three questions here. Because I want to know who is the she that is trying to kill the prophet, Jamila. I want to know who is Jezebel besides Jamila. But most of all, I want to know who is the prophet that she that I don't know who is, is trying to kill. I need these answers quickly. I need answers on this nonsense quickly. I need to know who is she that is trying to kill the prophet. Jamila, can you tell us who she is? I need to know who is the she that's trying to kill the prophet, Jamila. You said it. So we need answers. Tell the people who it is. Break it down, break it down, break it down. Who is the she that's trying to kill the prophet? Who is Jezebel besides yourself? And who is the prophet that the she that we need to know who is is trying to kill? We need these answers quickly. This is nothing but nonsense. The audacity of you, Jamila, to talk about somebody trying to kill somebody. But you brag about guns. And now you're trying to reverse, use reverse psychology on the fools. You're trying to insinuate that I am she. You're trying to insinuate that I am Jezebel. You're trying to insinuate that I am the one that's trying to kill the prophet and you is the prophet. You're trying to, re re you're trying to, re you're trying to use reverse psychology. On the fools. Like I'm out here trying to hurt you. Or I'm out here trying to harm you. Nope. Nope. You ain't you ain't gonna do that with nope. I'm not trying to harm nobody. I'm not trying to hurt nobody. I'm not trying to kill nobody. I'm not trying to fight nobody. I'm not even I'm not trying to do none of them things. I'm exposing somebody. I'm exposed. I'm being obedient to God. I'm exposing somebody. And that somebody is Jamila. I don't have a problem saying who I'm exposing. I've been saying your name for two years and six months plus. Who is the she that is trying to kill the prophet? Who is Jezebel? And who is the prophet that the she is trying to kill? I'm not trying to harm nobody. I'm not trying to hurt nobody. I'm not trying to kill nobody. Nope. I'm just exposing somebody. That's it. That's all. I'm exposing Jamila. I'm harmless. But this exposing assignment is tearing down Jamila's little empire. This exposing Jamila's so pressed because this exposing assignment is tearing down her little empire. It's tearing down her little empire. It's tearing down her little empire. And I'm coming back to break that all the way down. I will expose that in the morning. When Jamila up live in the morning, doing her little mess, I'm going to be up live in the morning exposing the difference between a ministry, a church, and an empire. Because Jamila exposed herself. She's so smart, but she can't be too smart because if she was smart, she wouldn't have got up there on the line today and said that she's so smart she built an empire because you've been lying saying that God gave you a church. You've been lying saying that God told you to pull the car over and start a ministry. See, that's why I got to come back and expose. 
That's why I got to come back and expose that. Jamila saying she's smart. She built an empire. This is her exposing herself. And her way of saying that she is a cult leader. She built the empire. Not going. She built the empire. CCM, UCI, that's an empire. That is not no ministry. That is not no church. Don't get mad at me. Get mad at Jamila. Jamila said it, not me. I've been saying it and y'all ain't believe me. I've been saying it and y'all ain't believe me. Jamila said it today. It's an empire. She's so smart. She built this empire. CCM, UCI. I've been saying that CCM wasn't no ministry. I've been saying UCI wasn't no church. Don't, don't shoot the messenger. Shoot the deceiver. Don't shoot the messenger. Shoot the deceiver. I've been trying to tell y'all. Hey, hey, niece. She said, hey, family, been in out this live, but just wanted to say Elijah is the biblical reference of the prophet that Jezebel was trying to kill. She forgot a point E and J had a go and stand off. Oh, yeah, I know what she was referring to, but being that she didn't use no scriptural reference, she just said it because she was talking about me. That's why I didn't go. I'm not I didn't go into the scriptural reference about it. I knew exactly who she was talking about. I knew exactly who she was talking about. But the thing that I'm saying, that's right, cut it out. She will never accept the challenge. That's why I didn't go into scripture reference. I, I follow the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit told me I didn't go in, I could have went into the scripture, but for what? You didn't use scripture reference. You just said, oh, that girl, she crazy. You didn't, you didn't refer that to nothing. That was your flesh. Like I've been saying, this whole ordained, God ordained exposing assignment. CCM, UCI is man-made. God did not ordain it, stupid fools. I've been saying that. And now Jamila get up there today and tell y'all, oh, I'm smart. Just built an empire. She monkey shining on y'all. Jamila running circles around them fools. She monkey shining on y'all. She got control. She got total control of them fools. She monkey shining on them. Robbing them, monkey shining, lying, controlling, manipulating them, fighting them. She even had the audacity to call some lady stupid. The only reason Jamila called that lady stupid is because I've been calling her stupid. Jamila, you're funny in a bad way. And you're fake in a good way. And the lake of fire awaits you, my dear. You little black butterfly. You remember you used to say that, Jamila? You little black butterfly. You funny in a bad way. You fake in a good way. And the lake of fire awaits you, Jamila. You little black butterfly. One last question, Jamila. One last question, stupid. You said, child, that girl is crazy. Who is the girl? Who is the girl you talking about, Jamila, that you said is crazy? She been here for years now. Been well. You too, you will get used to her. Used to what? And who is her? She has the spirit of Jezebel. Again, who is she? She trying to kill the prophet. Who is the prophet? I got so many questions for Jamila with that little bitty part right there. Who is the girl? Who is the girl, Jamila? Who is the girl that you say, child, she crazy? She been here for years now. Been well. I know, sweetie. I know, niece. You know, I'm talking straight to Jamila. So I read what you said, so I had to let Jamila know. I know me and you on one accord, niece. You already know that. I'm, I'm being stern towards Jamila because this is me addressing her because I know she listening. So I read your comments and I had to let her know. The reason why I ain't come from scripture with it because she didn't go to no scripture. But I very well knew what scripture was. She probably didn't. Jamila probably didn't. 
She been well for years. Who is she and where she been for years? Then she turned around and say, YouTube, you will be get you will get used to her. Used to what? She had the spirit of Jezebel. Who is she? She is trying to kill the prophet. Who is the prophet? I got so many questions to ask this lady with that one little point. Jamila. Jamila. I am begging you. Please. 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 Just explain that part of your today's message to me. And to the world. Even to those that you deceived. Who is she? Who is the girl? Who is she? Where she been for years? Used to do what? And who is her? Again, Jamila, who is she? But most of all, who is the prophet that this she is supposed to be trying to kill? Please. Please, please, if you don't explain nothing else, you ain't even got to explain you built it so smart that you built the empire. Please explain who is the girl? Who is she? Where she been? What they going to get used to her doing? Who is the prophet? These are the answers I want. It's bad enough that you had me in your thoughts. On Easter Sunday. Until I came out your mouth. You was talking to me. Talking about you. But for you to get up there today. After you took off yesterday. It speaks volumes. That I live rent free in your head. Jamila. How. See this is why you're mad. Thank you Holy Spirit. How do you feel about those numbers? You know you always be talking about numbers. Now you done got to the point. When, when I get to 1500. I, I, I ain't counting no more. But then you said it's 1502. You said you wasn't counting over 1500. And I'm going to let y'all listen to that too. Because I got that little stupid stuff. Because I'm at a teacher. 1502 people. I'm going to stop counting after 1500. It's 1,502 people on three different platforms. I realize now that this isn't working for me. I, I, I have to step away and learn how to handle myself. Because I'm at a teacher. 1,502 people. I'm going to stop counting after 1,500. It's 1,502 people on three different platforms. Make it make sense. I'm going to stop counting at 1,500 people. I'm going to stop counting at 1,500 people. It's 1,502 people. I'm going to stop counting at 1,500 people. It's already past 1,500 people if it's 1,502 people. If it's 1,502 people, you shouldn't even much been counting. Because you say you're going to stop counting at 1,500. Why you said 1,502? Then you say I'm going to stop counting at 1,500. You already should have been stopped counting. The reason why I'm talking about numbers is because Jamila is big on numbers. Jamila worried about the numbers. She worried about the numbers because when she's counting the numbers, she's counting up the money. That's the only reason she's worried about how many people on there. But me... I'm not concerned about numbers. I'm not concerned about y'all money. I'm concerned about the people's soul and their salvation and being led astray from going in the times that we are living in, the end times in the last days. But the reason why Jamila is mad and big mad is because Jamila is watching the numbers. And this is what I am about to ask her. Jamila, how do you feel about my numbers? From my live on yesterday when I exposed three different Easter Sundays. How do you feel about my live that I did yesterday superseding your numbers what you did on Sunday? That's why Jamila is mad this morning. Because Jamila got up and she looked at my live and she looked at her live. Her live is from two days ago. My live is probably 14, 15 hours. But my live on yesterday exposing the three different, total different, wrong Easter Sundays. 
The last time I checked it, hers read 2,341. I had 2,385. How do you feel about that, Jamila? How do you feel about a live that you had up here? You got so many people. How do you feel about your Easter Sunday live? My live that I did yesterday passed your live up in numbers. You so big on numbers. How do you feel about that? Mine was 12 hours ago when I wrote the notes. Hers was two days ago. That's why you up today so mad this morning, witch. Tell the truth, shame yourself. Tell the truth, shame yourself. You up there mad, upset, and angry because you trying to figure out how did her numbers pass my numbers and I did my live two days ago because God is doing his big one in the numbers over here. People are getting free. People are getting delivered. God is waking people up. God is removing the scales off of people's eyes and he is allowing them to remove the blinders so that they would no longer follow you. This witch, Jamila, is too pressed about Roshana and me exposing her. That's why you pressed. You pressed like a Navy SEAL suit standing up in the corner by itself. But the only reason that you pressed is because God had me exposing you. And this I know to be true. Jamila, you are big mad about the truth that I speak, but more so about the proof that I show. Because the Holy Spirit told me to let me let you see you. Let you see your own mistakes. That's why you notice I screen record all of the crazy stuff that you do. I don't watch you, Jamila. I don't watch you, baby. I don't listen to you. I get on and I just start straight recording because I know you finna say something stupid. You stupid. You're not wise. And that's how the Holy Spirit got me exposing you. By speaking the truth and showing proof. Putting it back in your face with screen records of you. Just like today. You sat there and said, she this, she that. You expose your big you, you expose yourself big time by saying that you're smart. So smart that you built an empire. You let the world know that CCM is not no ministry. UCI is not no church. It's a cult. It's a cult empire that you built, that you control, that you run. And now I'm gonna do a live straight on that. So tomorrow, Jamila, just know this. Wednesday morning, if you up and up on live, I will be up on live too. And I will be exposing you talking about you so smart that you started an empire. You built an empire. You ain't started. You built it. But you really started an online cult. So I'm going to see how you're going to come back from that one. Let's see how you come back for that. You get, Let's see if this is going to be what's going to make you tap out. Let's see how you come back, how you resuscitate. You say you need to be resuscitated. Let's see how you come back from this one. How you going to explain what you meant by that? Because it's the only one way that you could explain it. You don't have nothing else but CCM and UCI. So that is the empire. I want to tell y'all to beware of CCM. Beware of UCI. But most of all, beware of Jamila. Because God is nowhere in her. Therefore, God can be nowhere in this CCM, UCI mess that she calls an empire. That's right. You were so heavy in her mind that she couldn't even preach about the resurrection. That's right. Jamila said, and I'm ending it like this. I'm going to end it like this because this is what I'm going to come back with. Y'all will see me on this evening. I will be up here with the news about the ministry. And I will be back here this evening because this is where I'm supposed to be. And I'm supposed to be up here this morning about the ministry. But the Spirit said come do this. So I will be back this evening just to talk strictly about the ministry. To give y'all updates. To give y'all the news about the ministry. To share some great things about the ministry. And what scripture says about what we're doing in the ministry. But I'm going to leave this. I'm going to leave y'all with this. I'm going to leave this. Since I'm a stain on Jamila's brain, I'm going to leave a stain on y'all brain. Jamila says she's so smart that she built an empire. CCM UCI is a demonic cult empire. 
And that's the biggest red flag to wave on this Tuesday. For that statement alone, for that statement alone, Jamila saying that she built an empire. And I'm going to let y'all hear it. Because this is the stain I need to be on y'all brain. I need this stain to be on y'all brain. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they married me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. <laughs> I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, they was always getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit. When they was kids, One more time. they was getting sent home. So now those kids becoming adults. And guess what? Y'all marry them. I marry them. Oh, they marry me. Hit me. So pick up your phone. She said, I just threw my phone. And so when I begin to get mad, listen, when I, I don't care what y'all say. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm very smart. I built an empire. Watch this. And so when the Holy Spirit, when they was kids, She very smart. She can't be too smart because she got up here and said she built an empire. And she been saying she had a ministry and, and God gave her a ministry and a church. The red flag is she's so smart, but she really not smart. Because if she was smart, she wouldn't have never said on social media that she's so smart she built an empire. So I'm here to tell y'all, Jamila saying that she's smart. That she built the empire after lying for seven years. March the 30th, 2017. March the 30th, 2017 made seven years that Jamila been doing what she doing. Lying on God. And now she told the truth. Three days after. Look at God. Three days after the set. Three days after her seven year. March the 30th. Made seven years. March the 30th, 2017. 2017 to 2024, seven years, three days after. Y'all know things come in threes. Today is the third day, March the 30th, the 31st, the 1st, the 2nd. Today is April the 2nd. Three days after her seven year, she didn't expose that she built an empire. God ain't gave her no ministry. God ain't gave her no church. Three days. Everything happened on the third day. Look at God. Y'all know I'm coming back. Y'all know I'm coming back, right? I will be back in the morning full-fledged on Jamila with this empire stuff. And that's why I need to leave this a stain on y'all brain. Just like I'm a stain on her brain, this right here, her building the empire, need to be a stain on the world's brain. This, Jamila sitting there said, it's coming down sooner or later. It's coming down sooner than later. She ain't got too much longer to be pushing people on the floor. Push them 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 on the floor. She ain't got too much longer to be pushing them on the floor, y'all. She built this demonic online court organization that she is now calling her empire. That's the biggest red flag on this Tuesday for the statement alone, which went over. See, that statement that she made, she's so smart, she built an empire. That statement right there went over the fool's head like a rainbow. They heard her say it, but they didn't catch it. But guess what? It ain't go over my head because I'm a genius. But most of all, I'm a servant, and that's a plus. That's why the Lord let me catch it. I caught it. I caught it. But it went over the heads of all of those 1,500 people that was on their live. 
It went over their heads like a rainbow. But guess what? I'll be back. And the only thing that I'm going to be exposing when I come in the morning, we ain't going to hear nothing. Y'all going to, it's going to be like y'all heard a broken record. Because all we going to hear is Jamila say, I'm smart. I built an empire. I'm smart. I built an empire. That's the only thing that we going to hear tomorrow when I'm exposing Jamila in the morning. Y'all going to hear Jamila say, she's smart. She built an empire like it's a broken record. Because I'm going to make sure. I'm going to make sure that I have it recorded to where it can just play and play and play. Thank you, Holy Spirit, because I'm fixed to get off of here right now and put it together. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit said, because I'm fixed to get off of here right now and put it together. She built an empire. God ain't give her no ministry. I knew that. God ain't give her no church. I knew that. God ain't tell Jamila to pull no car over seven years ago. Jamila built the empire, and she exposed it herself today. So we thank God for allowing Jamila to do what the Holy Spirit told me that she was going to do anyway. On September the 9th, 2021, the Holy Spirit told me, Roshana, that if I was obedient to God and exposed Jamila by showing the receipts in my phone and speaking the truth, making it comical, funny, hilarious, comical truths, that Jamila would expose herself. And I have been witnessing you, Jamila, expose yourself. Lost and unlearned. God loves you enough to come back for you. You don't have to stay in this cult. Get free for free. Like, subscribe, and set your notifications to this page. To God be the glory. And I did it again, um, sis, niece. I did it again, niece. And I know you just seen me, but the spirit said no. So, lost and unlearned. Fools, those of y'all that watch Jamila, Jamila just exposed that she is a cult leader. She built the empire. God ain't give her no ministry. God ain't give her no church. God ain't tell her to pull no car over to deceive y'all. God loves y'all enough to come back for y'all. The Bible says, leave the 99 to go get the one. And that's what I do every day when I get up here to expose Jamila. I leave the 99 to go get the one. Because I know God love y'all enough to come back for y'all. You don't have to stay in this cult, CCM, UCI. You don't have to stay. You can get free for free by tuning in and listening to me. Speak the truth, but also show the proof. Relentless role. God ordained exposing assignment. Like, subscribe, and set your notification to this page so that you can get free for free. Jamila built the empire. But she been lying for seven years saying that God gave her a ministry. God gave her the world. God gave her a church. God gave her a world to warn, comfort, and correct. And all she been doing for seven years as of March the 30th, 2024, 20, is deceiving y'all and putting a price tag on scripture for y'all to sow on. See, Ro, that's why I like when you plan things on repeat because it absurdly passes me sometimes sometimes that's right that's right i have to y'all and that's how i'm coming in the morning i love y'all and i'll see y'all back up here this evening but i just want to let jamila know still at the end of the day we want to know who the she is we want to know who who you calling a jezebel we want to know who the prophet that the she is trying to kill she crazy she 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 been on there for a long time what she we want to know all of those god's timing yes it's over I can sing that to you, Jamila. It's over now. This CCM empire is over now. Jamila didn't, Jamila didn't did herself wrong today. Because y'all know I'm coming real strong. And I'm fixed to get up off of here. I got some notes. I got to go to work. Because not only do I got to write notes for this empire stuff, this is her building this empire, I have to write notes for the dialogue on the book tomorrow. Those of y'all that don't got Sabina Huffman's book off of Amazon titled Trap Within, please go get it because we are doing dialogues right here on that book and we do dialogues on Wednesday evenings. So tomorrow, I got to get prepared for tomorrow. Thank God that I already wrote the stuff that I had to write 
for the ministry today. So I will see y'all later on this evening. And those of y'all that are team players, make sure y'all are here. We will be speaking about, I will be explaining about the do's. I will be explaining about the tokens of love. I will be explaining and sharing the news of what we have did, where we have covered, all the things that the ministry have did. I will be coming with scripture telling y'all, you know, what the Bible says about what we are doing, how God has given us this peculiar ministry, and how I thank God for each and every one of y'all because he gave me the vision, but it, he used all the people all over the world for the provision to provide the things that we need so that we can go out and do it. So I will see y'all this evening um, around 6, 6.30, 7 o'clock with... Um, the ministry news and updates. But I will see y'all in the morning because we're going to talk about this. She's so smart that she built the empire. Thank you, Jamila, for exposing yourself. See you this evening, sis. Love y'all.